I am doing something completely out of my comfort zone. I decided two days ago that tonight I'm gonna throw an influencer party. CVX Live is this weekend, um, a YouTube conference. All these awesome moms are gonna be in town. And some friends that are coming into town for this, amazing mom influencers, and I'm like, we've gotta get together. Let's do my house, and I will invite all the moms that are coming into town, the moms that are already here, other influencers who are doing amazing things here in Utah that they can network with and talk to and create a relationship with, you know, to help spread each other's messages. And so I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do this. So completely out of my comfort zone. Are you kidding me? Sometimes you just gotta dive in, right? And I'm diving in. I gotta hit the bulk stores. I'm either gonna get help from Sam's Club or Costco. We're gonna throw together this party very fast. Sometimes it's better just to do something short notice and off the cuff. Sometimes it could be a little bit easier than having more time to think about it and plan. Yeah, you, yes, you could be ready, but I always second guess myself. There's no second guessing here. Like, we have to decide. Right, my first stop is at Sam's. I went online and I noticed that they had a lot of party pl platters, a different variety than Costco. So we're gonna see. Maybe I'll just end up getting everything here at Sam's Club. Might have to go to Walmart for what I wanna make for the drinks, but. Oh my gosh, check out this gourmet brownie tray. <laughs> wow. like party central in the back of my van so except for the the noodle so I'm gonna load things in but I'm gonna do the haul right here because once I get back into town I'm going to use my mother-in-law's refrigerator to put all this stuff in because my second refrigerator isn't hooked up yet this is the yummiest popcorn we have this at Callie's graduation party it's so Good, it's buttery caramel corn and real cheddar cheese corn. Okay, we got nine ounce clear cups and we're gonna just serve water. I was gonna do these really yummy fruit drinks but with my carpet, I don't wanna get anything stained on it so I'm gonna put fruit in the water, it's gonna be yummy. 300 piece plastic spoons and forks and I already have some plastic knives at home. This spinach dip looks so good. The spinach artichoke dip, oh my gosh. So we're gonna have that. I'm making a great big Caesar salad, so I grabbed some I uh, grabbed some croutons. One of the desserts is the 63 individual piece cheesecake miniatures, New York style cheesecake, caramel chocolate chip cheesecake, strawberry swirl cheesecake. And of course a veggie tray with cauliflower, broccoli, celery, peppers, and carrots. They had out to taste test this beef sirloin. It is amazing. So this gets sliced up really thin and we can have this with our sandwiches because I did grab this party tray. It has turkey, chicken, and two different hams. We're going to cut these in half so that they make more. And then we'll have that yummy sirloin with it. And we have some men that are coming and I'm sure they'll appreciate that. Well, it did look pretty until I got it in the car. This is a fruit tray. It has strawberries, different cheeses, grapes. And when I serve it, I'm gonna add some pineapple. These are wedges, we'll cut these, and some blueberries. So I grabbed two bags of chopped romaine lettuce to make the Caesar salad. I already have a triangle of Parmesan cheese that we could shred into it, and I already have a Caesar dressing. Okay, I have this shrimp platter, two pounds of shrimp. I have two of these broccoli salads. It's like the broccoli salad I make. I'll leave a link down below for you guys. Some lemon bites. There will be some kids that are coming, which I'm excited to meet my friend's children. Oh my gosh. So I grabbed also some brownie bites, rolls for the sandwiches, and some plates. These are hard to see. Some plates, and I did grab napkins and plates like this at Walmart yesterday.
It is quarter to 11 and I'm just finishing cleaning up. It went really, really well. It was so fun to finally see people that you've been friends with for a while and talk to online, but like to finally like be able to hug them and see them in person. It's it was just so great. It was so, it was a great night. So now it was just a fun kickoff for the weekend. It's gonna be a really fun weekend. I'm glad I got through my anxiety. I get anxiety about these things and social anxiety. Sometimes going to church, it's been happening to me with my anxiety. And I am a very outgoing person. I was a very outgoing teenager and in my 20s. I'd love to have a good time, but it's been to the point where sometimes it's hard to go to church. I get the pounding heart. I just think too much about it. And going to networking events and things, like once I'm there, I'm comfortable and I'm happy. But beforehand, it's like racing thoughts, you know, talk myself out of going. And, and for me to do this within not even two days, it was like a day and a half is like, wow. I am glad I pushed through the fear and was like, no, we're doing this. We are doing this. And I'm so glad I did. They got to meet other women in the area who do great things. and. Just networking, it was really good. So I'm glad I did it. I pushed through the fear. Friendships were made, connections were made, and that is so important. You can pull off a party really quickly. I usually shop at Costco, but man, Sam's Club, they did, they did it tonight. They, they scored big with me tonight. Thank you so much for joining me, you guys. I hope you're doing good, and we will see you soon.